Hey, what's up everyone? Gids here for another Nino Kuni Crosswords video. And today we have a new server merge announcement. So let's see what this notice has for us. This is my first time checking on this, so bear with me, okay? Server merge will be taking place for all of the servers through the 222 update. Okay, so it's going to happen February 22. Um, that's a month from now, so let's, let's wait for it. I don't know if we're still playing by that time, but hey, let's go. Okay. Server more merge purposes to provide a more pleasant game environment for sure because a lot of servers are dead. To improve areas where large differences in combat power between servers limit soul divers participation such as cross server content. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, servers that are not really participating in cross server and in cross field. So this is the list. Ooh, let's go. Okay, I'm not sure about the NA and EU region so just check out which servers you belong to look at those and then after you merge so for example this one looks like it's three servers into one so Onyx Cancer, Onyx Virgo and Onyx Aris will be combined into one and it will become Snow Jayco afterwards okay so all the three will be combined into one basically so all the accounts that are in these three servers will be combined into the servers that are on the right. We also have South America. Ah, oh, South America is just two servers each. Okay. Europe has three servers each that gets transferred and Asia three as well. So let's see where we land. Um, okay, where is Aqua Cancer? Okay, Aqua Cancer, Sand Cancer. Oh, let's go. And Sand Capricorn. So Welcome to you guys. We're now Pyro Crux. I don't like it. I like Cancer more. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna be transferred over there. So Pyro Crux is going to be my new server after this server merge update. So just check out this list. I'm gonna link this down in the description below so that you can check it out for yourselves which servers you will be landing on. Okay, so hopefully this will balance out cross server. So in Asia, We'll have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Okay, so there's going to be 11 servers left after the merge, which is good. That's a huge cut down of the number of servers that we currently have, which is good. Okay, account guidelines. So I think this one's going to be important. When two or more servers you play are merged together, account information for all servers will be preserved. So if ever you are playing in two servers, I don't know why you would be playing in two servers, then both information for both servers will be preserved. So for example, I have an account in Aqua Cancer and I created a second account in Sand Cancer. Both information will be preserved, I believe. Right? So you will still have the data of both accounts. Uh, the first, when you log in for the first time after the server merge, you will be logged into the account of the last server you accessed before the server merged. So, for example, I last used my Aqua Cancer account, then I'll be getting my Aqua, or I'll be logging into my Aqua Cancer account. Okay. Afterwards, change account will allow you to switch and play the account from a different server from before the server merge. Okay, so there's still possibility for you to change your account. So if you want to choose a different account that you've been using before, so for example, you accidentally left your last login as the Sand Cancer account, then you can still switch it over to the real account that you are using. So this is just within one account, okay? Take in mind because it is possible to create multiple accounts, multiple characters in different servers, right? You can choose your server and create new accounts there, but of course, there's always going to be that one main account that you will be using. That's what we're, they're trying to do here. And then, based on the terms of service, inactive accounts that were not accessed for 180 days or longer may be deleted. Okay, so if your account has been inactive for 180 days is six months, I think. Six months, it will be maybe deleted, okay? So if you've been inactive for six months, it's a bye bye Changes in each content due to the server merge, okay? So for each character, for your mailbox, mailbox. Information will be retained. Deck information will be retained. And of course, growth content. So achievement, codex, collection, yada, yada, yada will be retained, which is good. Definitely should be like that. <laughs> Don't reset anything there. Friends list, of course, will be retained. Tagline will tag, tagline will be retained. Wall information will be retained. 
Familiar forest details such as object placement will be retained. Okay, good. Dual yard will be reset and start over. Okay, this one, there's no issue with this one getting reset, right? Because there's a lot more players that are gonna come in and you should reset it. I mean, dual yard doesn't really matter that much. Honor points and grade will be preserved. Okay, no problem. Okay. Scores for the Lava Valley and Temple Arena will be preserved. So this doesn't really matter because it's not just server-wide, right? This is region-wide, region, region -wide, so it doesn't matter. Ongoing season schedule will continue without any changes, okay? Uh, Relic Wars, the February 18th sat or the Saturday Relic Wars and the corresponding bidding prediction will not be held. Okay, so for one week, there will be no Relic Wars. So that's going to be the week of this one, February 18th. That's here. Existing Relic buff benefits will end on 2.18, so February 18th, okay? Bidding will start 2.24, okay? So this is after the server merge already. Okay, I see. So just one week before the server merge, no Relic Wars will be held. Okay, now let's look at, okay, Familiar Arena, there might be some good stuff here. Battle records before the server merge will be preserved. Okay, rankings will be renewed based on the Soul Divers scores from the merge servers. Hmm, what does this mean, renewed? Uh, are they going to merge all the rankings, the points, right? So they're just going to base it on the current points that you have from your current server versus the other people. So for example, if you're 2000 points right now and you're rank number 99, for example, and then there's a player from Sand Cancer that's 2001 points, then they're going to push you down. You're gonna go down to rank 100. I think that's what they mean here. We'll see though. Familiar Arena scores will be retained after merging servers, okay. Data for Familiar Arena or Replay History will be reset. Okay, so no one cares about the history anyway. I don't know if many people are actually looking at this, so let's see. Titles from previous season will be retained as is. Okay, yeah, it should be. <laughs> and then there may be more than one Soul Diver with the ranking 1 title for a certain period of time. Wait, what? How? There may be more than one Soul Diver with the ranking 1 title for a certain period of time. Ah, I see, I see. Hmm? Okay, so it's just a title. It's just a title. Because there's a weekly title for Familiar Arena and if you're number 1 in your previous server and your current server, then it's possible. Okay, okay, that, that, that makes sense. So uh, for that week only, there will be two people that are holding or two or three people that will be holding the number 1 Familiar Arena rank, okay? And then the ongoing season schedule will continue without any, any changes, okay? So that's the only thing that you have to note here. So nothing will be changed. It's just really going to be merged. So whatever your points are, you'll be ranked against the other players in the server, in the new merged server, okay? Fight for the throne. Fight for the throne on 2.12 Sunday will proceed as planned, okay? And capital perks obtained before the server merge will end. Okay, all the capital merge, uh, capital perks will end. That makes sense because you'll no longer be holding the capital after a server merge. Okay, cross field. Okay, since the boss contribution rank one count and occupancy occupancy count are reset, server ranks will also be reset. Okay, so all rankings will be reset. So no more aqua cancer number one. After the server merge, the crossfield matching groups will be rearranged, okay? And then the number of crossfield bosses defeated by a server for the access restriction for each floor will be based on the server with the highest defeat count among the merged servers. Wow! The servers coming into our <laughs> coming into Aqua Cancer are going to have a huge benefit on this. I think we've defeated all the bosses so far. Alright, okay. Regular Kingdom. Okay, Kingdom changes. Kingdoms will be preserved the same as before the server merge. Okay. Then Capital Kingdom, Relic Wars, and Fight for the Throne records will be reset. Of course, that makes sense. It will be reset. And all of the records, including join requests, will be preserved. And records for the Kingdom Defense, Invasion, and War Archives will be preserved. So there's not much that's going to change. Elements for the weekly dungeon will be reset to fire. So there's not much that changes here. Okay. 
Next, overall rankings. So for rankings, ranking applied on the server before the server merge will be reset and only the ranking information will be retained. Wait, ranking? What does this mean? All rankings will be recalculated by players' nick nicknames based on the ranking information. So it's going to be, I think this is the ranking based on CP, right? CP and all those kinds of stuff for the titles. Certain rankings will be recalculated based on the characters with level 80 or higher or a character with less than level 80 will be reflected in the ranking after carrying out an action related to the rank. I don't, I did not understand this one, but anyway, I think the ranking for overall ranking for the titles, it will just be merged again. So if ever the highest CP or yeah, highest CP and the current server, for example, Apple Cancer is 7M, 7 million CP and Sand Cancer has 7 million and 1 CP, then they will move up to number one, something like that. Okay, and then the 7 MCP guy will move down to number two. Okay, weekly rankings, all of the weekly rankings will be reset, that makes sense. Titles, okay, titles should be preserved. And achievements, the pioneer title and achievement obtained after becoming the first to reach level 100 in the server will be preserved after the server merge. Ah, okay, so that's good. So all the people that achieve this will still have their pioneer title. That's good for them. Okay, quest, so progression. So anything quest related will be retained. Labyrinth of Dreams will be preserved. Familiar adventure. So if you are doing some familiar adventure, then it will be preserved. Adventure record and replay will be res uh, reset. So doesn't really matter. Event. So for the event, all of the current event records will be preserved, which is expected. Money ma'am. Retained information shops. Retained items being sold will be retained. Remaining sellable amount. Okay, will be reset. That that makes sense, but I don't think it's ever reset at all, really. Okay. Next for the shop. I don't even wanna read about the shop. <laughs> Anyways, uh, mostly it's going to be preserved, right? And power packages will be preserved. So whatever boodle shop that came up will be preserved. Purchase daily adventure, daily premium, that I, okay, the daily stuff will be extended by two days. Good. All of the loyalty, loyalty points from familiar salmon, equipment salmon, and costume salmon will be retained when servers are merged. Okay, good. Token exchange will be reserved, uh, preserved. So Marblex wallets will be preserved. Web shops, okay, resort, uh, re retained, okay. Chat, all chat records except for the one-on-one -on -one chat will be reset, okay. And then block chat list will be preserved. PK, PK information retained. Buff will be preserved. Solo training records will be preserved. Street stalls will be sent to the game inbox. So anything that you have on your street stall will come back. AI mode time will be retained, which is good. And few spot gauge will be reset, doesn't matter. Hopefully it gets filled up much faster than before. Progress report, of course, will be preserved. Nothing will be changed. And official forum. No one really uses the forum, no? Is there anyone that really uses the forum over here? I don't know. <laughs> I think people only use it whenever there's an event, so. Hmm, okay. So I don't want to read this, doesn't matter. Okay, so the above details may change during the server merge process. If changed, we will notify you through this notice. Okay, through this mer server merger, we hope that Soul Divers can enjoy more diverse content. Good, good. Okay, so that's all the changes. I don't think there's anything really significant. Probably Familiar Arena would just be harder. There are more wheels that will be coming in. Top 100 will be so much more competitive. But we'll see, alright, we'll see. So at least um, once you get knocked out of top 100, you'll not be automatically be down to top 10%. But we will still see. Anyways, that's it for me. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And if there's anything you don't understand, ask questions around in the comments below as well. There are a lot of people that answer the questions. Me as well. I try to look into them as much as possible. Okay. Thank you very much for watching. See you again next time. Like, subscribe, share if you haven't yet. See you again next time. Bye-bye. GG's.